This is a model of cognition uh, put together by cognition, so how we think by Cronin and Lowenstein. And the argument is that insight occurs at the highest level. Most of us spend most of our time just we perceive the world, we recognize some kind of problem, we make an inference based on our rules like our math problem that we just talked about and we respond to it and so we just use our existing cognitive or mental frames to go through life and, and do what we do. Sometimes we come across things that are like harder than what we expected and when that happens our first instinct is can I stay with my same frame but just add some stuff to it rather than actually have to change my frame and so we recall some ideas, we elaborate and then we try to solve it further. But we haven't really changed our frame, our way of thinking about things. And so it really only is when we come across things that are important enough to us to do the work and hard enough that we can't get through it that we instinctively start to try to acquire insight into what we do. So here we have to assume and inquire. And even then, after we do it, we have to restructure our way of thinking. But then in order to actually make it practical and useful, we have to go back and put these insights into practice which takes further work. So there's a, the moment, the aha moment, where we actually have some new way of thinking, but then that aha moment isn't enough if we can't actually put it back into our framework. 